Hello and welcome to Body Game Wonderful Community. In this video, we'll be learning how to transition smoothly from one track to another. In this case, we have two tracks loaded here. We have one on deck B, which is not playing at the moment. Then we have one on deck A, that is the first one, deck one, which is already playing. So, what you are going to be doing now is you are going to be using your keyboard to do virtually all the controls that you can do on your controller or on your deck. You are going to see everything here, how everything works smoothly, very simple, very soft and easy. Remember, when it comes to transitioning, having a very smooth transitioning, you have to be mindful of your low frequency, which is this very one. Remember, low frequency are heavy in nature. They create a lot of bass. So, for us to transition from one beat to another, you have to make sure that the, beat, the low frequency of one of the track goes down while the other one is coming up. You are going to see it in action and we will start it in detail. So, our mapping is already fixed. Let's go to see everything in detail. So, the next thing we will do is, while the track is currently playing on the low frequency, remember, we are going to be taking note of these keys that we are using. We are going to be using this letter Y. Look at it. So you can see how it is morphing the sound down and bringing it up. So it's controlling the low frequency, filtering it properly and very smooth for the audience to listen to what we are doing. Even us too, we are going to be enjoying it. So that is the beauty of being a DJ, you can see. So the next thing that will happen is you lift it up using F, letter F, to put the sound if you look at it. So at this point, you can see it brings it up, but when you use control this, it brings down the filter again. Then you use the you use the Y to reduce the filter and control Y to raise it up again. So this is going to be one of the control that we are going to be using. Then because we're going to start the next track in a way that it flows with the beats of the first track, that means our track is already loaded here you can use this alphabet just a tap on it when you select any track on your list it's going to automatically load to the deck so it's already loaded the next thing there is we are going to set our queue to one we have already set the hot queue on the first bit of it look at it so everything is okay it means the song can start confidently but we are not going to start it to allow it to roll completely we want to combine it using loops that's why i told you you don't underestimate the power of loops you get to see because if we allow it to play continuously it will make a mess of this particular beat that is currently playing so we want to pick a segment of the song that will flow with it so watch we have set it on loop one that's why you can see it here it's already showing exactly loop one that means it's picking one beat and it's going to be repeating that beat continuously so that is it then we are going to be using the morphing sound before after setting it on loop one the next thing we'll do is we'll reduce the filter down you can see by control this that brought down the filter we want to reduce it the more again by using the one data y you see data y has brought it down the more so at this point we'll go back to our deck one using this tab key then we'll raise it so now it is fully loaded it is on high frequency everything is okay so we are going to introduce the incoming track now look at it So you can see everything is going smoothly you can see everything is going smoothly so we are going to be bringing it up you can see now this deck is fully active then we have reduced this one we have reduced deck one so the next thing we'll do is we are going to be shifting it we are going to be allowing it to control we are going to be increasing the loop to make it grow so at this point we'll go back to our deck one by tapping on this we are going to be reducing it we are going to reduce the filter we are going to use the morphing sound look at it control this you see then why then we are going to be playing around with it you can see how we are enjoying it you 
can see everything is going smoothly. I'm sure you are enjoying the beat. So don't forget to keep a date as I continue to bring you more jokes. How everything is going smoothly just with our keyboard and we are flowing around with it. At this point, we want to use the loop to reduce it and to take it out. The next thing we we'll do is we will now go back to our letter 8. This 8, we are going to be cutting it into half, 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 continue, until we continually take it out. Look at it. 1, 2, 3 3 You can see We are introducing a new vibe control it with By just tapping You can see everything is completely out Just with our echo out I believe you enjoy it So don't forget to keep a date As I continue to bring you more Fire! So you can see, I've successfully moved from Afro beats to another different genre hip hop completely. Yes, no fire coming. So catch you in my next video. Don't forget to keep it dead. As I keep it locked, it's your boy right here on the wheels. Deal. Check this out.